Bowing to growing international pressure, Afghan President Hamid Karzai is set to concede he was not the outright winner in that disputed election and discuss, discussing the possible unity government to, ha to happen the next, very soon. CBS News correspondent Mandy Clark is in Kabul with the tales. Mandy, good morning. Good morning. Yes, President Karzai is expected to soon announce that he will accept the findings of an inquiry that put him as not the clear winner. The UN-appointed commission investigating the August vote found fraud so pervasive that hundreds of thousands of ballots will be thrown out. It dropped Karzai's share to about 48 percent and stirred concern here that he would reject the audit. Karzai faced American pressure. Senator Kerry met with him this morning, and Secretary of State Hillary Clinton's statement added to pressure on him. But we have continued to urge that everyone follow the Constitution and the legal process, uh, which uh, is uh, important for the uh, people of Afghanistan and uh, their leaders. It is up to the Afghan Election Commission to decide whether there will be a runoff, which according to the constitutional law will need to happen in two weeks. Local television's reports claim that Karzai and Abdullah Abdullah are discussing uh, national unity. However, uh, spokesman for Abdullah has told me such reports are propaganda. Russ? Mandy Clark in Kabul. Thank you very much.